kill us, but and brunt! Oh, they really do belabor this, don't they? Okay, that's it. I've seen enough. I'm out of here. For nearly a decade, we've watched the saints as they rose from humble beginnings to becoming an unstoppable force of nature. In that time, we've seen how the saints rose to power. We've seen how the saints enact vengeance. We've even seen how the saints united both humanity and velociraptors. But for the first time ever, I share with you their most important story yet. For this, my friends, is how the saints saved Christmas. Are you gonna help or what? I wasn't planning on it. Come on, don't be such a grand. I don't even know what that means. What sort of childhood did you have? I just think there's more important things to think about than some bullshit holiday. Looks like someone never got on the nice list. Yeah, and see, that's the thing. There is no nice list. So Christmas, Kwanzaa, Hanukkah, Yule, Festivus? You don't care about any of it? That's right. You don't like the songs? Nope. You don't like the gift giving? I already take whatever I want. I said giving. Whatever. You don't get excited about setting up the Nightblade Nativity every year? Uh, that's slightly intriguing, but no. What about Santa? Fuck Santa! What's happening? Were we hit? No, the proximity alarm didn't go off. This is something different. Shandy? We don't have a lot of time. Claus is coming. What? Claus. A warlord from my time. Your future. By the time we learned about him, it was too late. He was too powerful. The only chance we had to stop him was to send me back here to warn you. Oh, wait. If you could go back in time, why didn't you go back even further and warn us about Zinyak? Isn't that a little more important? You don't get it. This isn't about Earth. Come midnight, Christmas Day, Santa Claus is coming to town, and unless we stop him, he is going to put the universe on the naughty list. And trust me, you don't want to be on the naughty list. Sorry I asked. So Santa's evil? No, Zinyak's had Santa trapped for decades, slowly but surely degrading his mind. If we don't free him soon, it'll be too late, and he'll never be jolly old Saint Nick again. Guys, this is the stupidest thing I've ever heard. All right, all right, I'll save Santa. Oh, look, a 
Another terrible fucking sweater. Thanks, Kinsey. In Santa's nightmare world, the holiday spirit doesn't exist. So if you want to bring it back, you wear whatever it takes. Real guns aren't allowed here, so we'll have to check the store and do a little holiday shopping. Also, be careful of your language around Santa. We're trying to stay on his nice list. Are you serious, Shondi? Come on, the town department store is just ahead. Is this crowd for us? They're here for the Crimson Cowboy Carbine Action 200 Shot Range Model Air Rifle. So I did a naughty thing. You have no idea what that causes. Look. Those who are naughty look to the sky and see your doom with the naked eye. You willfully break the world's laws. Now feel the wrath of the mighty claws. A fudge. Come, come as fast as you can. You can't stop me or my gingerbread men. Goods. Honestly? You know, forget understanding. I'm just gonna shoot this cunt. Wait! The claws are still too strong, and you'll shoot your eye out! Is it really you? I always warn children about the dangers of such toys. But why do you look so thin? The holiday spirit doesn't exist here anymore. Claus made sure of that. So, Sansa, how do we stop him? Start by ringing the holiday bells in the town park. That should bring a little spirit back to the people. We're here. Ring the bells and then let's kill Cole. My dear Shami, don't let your metallic parts turn your heart cold as well. Remember the holiday spirit you felt when you were younger. You know my name? Santa. I'm sorry. I've had no choice but to harden myself to fight the war. I... I forgot how it used to be. Don't worry. That same girl is still inside you. In fact, I'll bet there'll be a brand new hockey sack under the tree for you this year. You need it? Thanks, Santa. I wonder what would happen.
began ringing in the cheers, but more needs to be. I regret asking, but what did you have in mind? There was once a theater in town that played one of the great holiday classics, but the projector was stolen and frozen in a pool by claws. Find that, and the people will remember what they loved about the holidays. Showing a film is our best weapon. It is not just a movie. It is a symbol of all that is good about this time of year. Don't worry, sir. We can get the projector. so they don't hurt the projector when you grab it. Get it to the drive-in theater and turn on the magic of the season. Call the movie what it is, won't you? Oh, it's more than simply that. It creates a feeling of joy and happiness that comes with remembering the warmth this season brings to those who embrace it. Johnny, is he serious? Yes. Now quit being Grinch. I told the other you I don't know what that means. It stings and burns, but that's not enough for the tide to turn. We brought him down. But he's not defeated yet. The electricity here just isn't enough to keep the projector working. We need more. I noticed precisely that while viewing your progress from our ship. Meet me at the clock tower and I will increase the power. And it is a pleasure to meet you, Sid. Come on, Sid, where are you? Up, at the top of the clock tower! Keep Claus's minions from hurting me while I set up a conductor on this antenna. Come again? A storm is brewing, and lightning is sure to strike. <laughs> what a wonderful idea. You must be joking. Sid, do you know what happened to the North Pole? Sadly, I do. Claus has shown me images of an attack on my workshop. My head elf, Twinkle, has even joined me. He's the one who took my arm. And so did my arm. But there is hope. The rest of the elves are being led by Tinsel against Claus's naughty force. And Mary? Oh, 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 oh. Don't 
worry about Mrs. I'm sure she can take care of herself and the North Pole until we arrive. That's good to hear. If Claus gets his hands on the North Pole, then we're in serious trouble. I need you to put your tongue on the pole to help conduct the electricity. The fuck you say? Not in front of Santa. Come on. Even Santa can't think this is a good idea. No. Well then, I dare you. Jesus, are you all right? Holy, I'm not talking to you right now. The power is restored. Good luck defeating Claus. I can feel the people in town filling with cheer. Hurry, we must return to the driver. The spirit's alive, but still I live. Come face me now, there's punishment to give. Don't let him fool you. He's weakening. Keep your suits on, Santa. I got this. Once I turn this on, he better die. a holiday here you cannot say. I will not go to an early grave. Sorry, mate. I'm not giving you a choice. Wait! What are you doing? Oh, my God! Hold on. How'd he get away? You cannot defeat Claus by doing naughty deeds, for those are what he thrives on. Claus is going after the North Pole, and we have to stop him. Indeed, you are correct. We cannot leave Mary and the elves to face him alone. I better not be swarmed by elves. I finally get to see it before it's been destroyed. <laughs> and perhaps make sure it never is. Claus has taken over Santa's workshop. He plans to deliver bombs and guns to children instead of, you know, dolls and trucks or whatever it is kids from your time like. The elves have mounted a resistance, but they will fail unless you help them. If Claus succeeds, the holidays are doomed. You must stop him. Here we are. My workshop is just ahead.
Baker, it's hard to say what Claus has turned it into. And Mrs. Claus? What about her? Oh, I wouldn't worry. If I know my wife, I bet she's decking the halls as we speak. Savages have set my prized pine aflame. And is that... Is that Dancer? Dancer? Oh, oh no. Oh no, 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 no. Oh, sweet Cupid. Dixon, what have they done? Shorty! Protect Kringle! I didn't come here to observe, child. I'm taking the North Pole back. Yes, and you tell me. Grandma! What's going on, Denzel? Claus has taken over the workshop. He turned Twinkle and the boy. He's from shipping and receiving against us. Claus isn't going to get away with this. Twinkle even created a fleet of evil mechanical reindeer. So this is where the reign of mechanical animals began. has enacted emergency shutdown. Claus probably wants to use those mechanical reindeer to escape. Take us to the stable. <laughs> killed my precious reindeer friend and made these these abominations claws it's one twist this is by far the worst thing i've ever done with my hand Oh dear, here. There are other stables around. I'll take you there. What a wondrous flying machine.
is over. Twinkle. How could you? Claus gave us a better deal, Blumpy. Weekends off, sick pay, and we get to make guns. Real ones. He's on the move. My goodness. Claus has turned Twinkle and his cohorts into giant elves. Where are they? Right there. Can't you see? Uh, I just see normal sized people, Nick. Normal size to you, but giant for elves. Time to paint the snow red! The elves are in charge now. Down with Santa's tyranny! My most trusted elf. He's been with me so long, I can't believe he betrayed me. It'll be okay, Santa, right? Right. Yeah, right. Wow, boss. Real convincing. What's next? We have to get into the workshop. Are you seriously feeling nothing here? Christmas is dying right before your eyes. Sorry, Sean, he just doesn't do anything for me. That is so sad. Okay, here's the packing area. This is where the magic happens. And where the magic will die if we don't act soon. Don't say that, Santa. We're going to stop, Claus. We're going to fix the future. With the front closed off, the only way into the workshop is through the present sorter. Do you have any shiny red paper? Shandy, dear, can you be a good girl and stay here? If we don't make it, you have to tell the others. I'm not leaving your side, Santa. I need you to do this for me, Shandy. What? I've come too far to stop now. Do you know what I've been through? I've lost friends, compatriots, my arm! And an eye. Yes, and an eye! I can't just give you up, Santa. This is about something much bigger than me, Shandy. This is about Christmas. And those other holidays, too. Fine. Fine. I'll stay. But don't forget about me. Thank you.